This video is for those of you who are trying to figure out if their timing is on or 180 degrees off. If you are only one tooth off, you should be able to move the distributor enough to fire the engine and then change the distributor accordingly. Now, remember a couple things. Number one is if you go through the setting up of the valves with a book and you start out at top dead center number one cylinder firing and you do the exhaust one three four eight and then you do the intake one two five seven and then you spin the engine over 360 degrees and you do exhaust two five six seven and intake three four six eight in order to be back on top dead center number one cylinder firing you need to turn the crankshaft over 360 degrees again before you install the distributor otherwise the distributor will be 180 degrees off and it will be firing number six instead of number one so you got to remember that point now to verify that you are on number one cylinder firing position you can go through and check your valves because on the number one cylinder firing position you will be able to adjust one three four eight exhaust and one two five seven intake so if you go one three four eight exhaust that would be one okay three four eight exhaust all of those lifters will be at the bottom of their travel if you can't figure out whether you're at number one cylinder firing or number six cylinder firing which would be 180 degrees off of the distributor but 360 degrees off on the rotation of the crankshaft the best way to figure it out is to put a dial indicator on number five cylinder the third one back on the exhaust valve put a dial indicator on the rocker arm and verify by turning the crankshaft over that the number five exhaust rocker lifter is at its fullest lift that would mean that you are on number one cylinder firing